Here's where we started in our last video, with the tall grass growing where we want to have a garden. We said we were going to do cleaning of the ground for a garden. Is it possible to get rid of all of this and get a garden started? How long is that going to take? You'll remember that Salvador, J.R., was working along with Mock Mock. And this is where they were at the beginning of August the 4th. At the end of August the 4th, this is what it looked like. There is Jade working. Jade has worked up a plot and she's finishing that up now. The crop down in front is Alagbati. You can see the pink shoots that have been planted and this is what they'll look like when they're mature. They'll be harvested and boiled and served. Jade is an accounting major at AUP, Adventist University of the Philippines. Salvador, grade 6, ready to graduate at the end of this school year from San Rafael Seventh-day Adventist School. All of our students in the Philippines have to attend school online. There is no face-to-face -face classes taking place. This is what they did today. Hi, Salvador. This is Jessa talking. And first day. Yes, Jade is doing. <laughs> He's, she's making a plot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jade, push me yan. <laughs> yeah, this is what I told you, Daddy. Plot. <laughs> Jade said that that was their um, work when there was when they were at Nagabyo. And hi, Ma. Isang <laughs> kita ka, Dad. So, Mak Mak is a theology student at, AUP, at uh, Nagaview College, sorry. All of these students will be attending school online from our house where they are living. We have 14 people at the table consistently, and sometimes there are more. So, there is young Salvador. Salvador is observing this whole process and learning. So at the end of the first day, we went from this to this, all in day one. I asked Jessa to buy some tools, and she bought these. And I said, Jessa, many tools. She said, yes, Daddy, we have many hands. And that's exactly right. Many hands will be at work. Uh, each of the students living at the house will be working a period of time each day in the garden to help uh, support the table as well as to learn about this process so that if nothing else, they know how to plant and care for and harvest a garden. Jessa told me a story some time ago I may have shared it before, but their dad died when she was 13. She stayed home from the funeral and took care of Salvador, age one at the time. They needed a well. So Jessa and Mama Josie dug a well, a three foot wide well, 18 feet deep going down a bamboo ladder, digging up the dirt, putting it in a basket, somebody up above hauling the dirt out of the hole. Can you imagine being in a three-foot hole 18 feet down into the ground? These people know how to work, and they have to work because they don't have a man in the family to help provide for them. They're all workers. We appreciate them. And we're just so impressed by what they've accomplished in one day. 
You can see that they have extended cleaning. There will be more grass cleaned and more uh, plots, as they call them, being worked up to plant. Each plot allows the worker to work from the outside, reaching in to care for the plants and remove the weeds. Hope you enjoyed our video today, day one. More later.